keep the Vikings out of the end zone. Diaz takes the snap. He's rolling to his left. Throws one in the flat, and this is going to produce a touchdown. Diving for the pylon, that is Leland Crawford, who's back in the lineup last week and already making an impact for Valley. Yeah, the coach talked about Leland Crawford. Second and short, Wrangles firing it downfield. Pitch and catch, and inside the five again, and Wrangle is starting to find a groove here, complete to Aviles. And Crawford, he just found a, a seam in that Sun Devils defense. And that had to be blown coverage in that. And Robert Cutt said at halftime, we got to slow down number nine. That was it. He literally did, Kenny. He got the handoff and he kind of bounced and landed, you know, the drive of the second half for the Vikings. They go Wildcat. Jones has it. He goes off the left side and he is in for six. Nice drive. Yeah, very nice. Very nice drive. Start the second half. You come out. Uh, you got the momentum going in. One of the ways. First down. Wrangle rolls to his right. He's been dangerous with this formation. And look at that on the money. When he rolls to his right, he is dangerous. Wrangle floats one home. And Andy Aviles comes up with it. And the Sun Devils indeed do answer the Vikings score. Boy, that was a great drive, a great answer. They get the kick return out past midfield, and then a couple of nice runs, one by Wrangle. Then you get the roughing the passer. And then Avilas, fourth catch of the night, fourth touchdown on the season. He's Kenny, their go-to guy. Hey, look, Leland Crawford's been their go-to guy in the red zone. And guess what he is again? Three touchdowns. Third one of the night for Leland Crawford. Diaz and Crawford have a little chemistry shake in here, especially in the red zone. Over the middle of the field, and I believe just in the last nick of time. Meistus breaks. Meist inside handoff, Perez, and he cuts inside, and he's got a touchdown. We got a ball game. We're four for four.